Welcome back, this is Yam Jack. We've done Pallet Town this week. It's only right to do Lavender Town. Suicidal Gunslinger as well, right? It's only right. I want to get all the Pokemon. You know what I want to do? <laughs> this would be, be a fun week. Is have all of the, like, different areas in Pokemon. Like, uh, as maps. And then go and play through them all, like, in order. In a week. Like in, in the, the Kanto region or the Johto region or something. It could be kind of fun, right? Could be kind of fun. Yo, I was looking at, uh, actually, I was looking at Pokemon the other day. And, uh... I saw, I saw, I saw, what, what, why was I talking, why was I thinking about Pokemon? Mm, I forget why I was thinking about Pokemon, but I was thinking about Pokemon. And, uh, so I started looking up, like, what they looked like today, just to see if, like, the art style had changed, or if they looked visibly older. Because I knew, uh, I knew uh, before it was canon, basically, that they didn't age, right? Like, they, they, they stayed the same age forever. They were always 11 years old, right? I was like, I wonder if maybe that changed. So I was, I was looking up some stuff, and they have... Butchered the art design of Pokemon. Just tossed it in the trash. It looks horrible. Just absolutely horrible. I liked. I watched uh, like Pokemon from like episode one, right until I don't know whenever Charizard got uh, left at the the tower and I, or at the the like mountain region for training, and I couldn't. Continue watching any marks my mother banned Pokemon from me because apparently it was traumatizing me. Little did she know that uh, her behavior was actually the traumatizing one. Anyway, um, I, I watched up until that point, but I watched episode one, right? So I was, I was watching like real early on in the series, like that very early, the wee, the wee years of, of Pokemon, right? And uh, that's uh, that like. Um, oh right, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we were talking about, um, like, anime in general, and the, uh, the, like, aesthetic the anime goes to with that, with the, like, just ridiculously sharp, like, jawline, where their chins are, like, fangs, you know? And, uh, so I shared a picture of Pokemon, where, uh, where, like, it was Brock, and his face is, like, square as heck, right? Um, so then I started looking up the rest of the Pokemon and I found that uh, the newest Pokemon just looks ridiculous. Like, Ash. Just... The other characters almost look okay, but Ash just looks like an entirely different character. Like, just completely different. I'll, uh, I'll have a link to in the description to, uh, like, a comparison. But, uh, like, wow. It was, uh, it was, it was shocking to see because, like, what, what Ash used to look like to me is, like, iconic Pokemon, right? Like, that's the pinnacle of anime, and, uh, and, you know, like, that, that's, that's classic and, and iconic, and, uh, to have seen them just completely ruined it like that, it's just, it was, it was, it was, it felt really bad. I'm like, you just... This, this was my childhood, and you just you ruined it. <laughs> so, I don't know, there, there'll be a link in the description if you care to, uh, to see the, um, the, the difference, and, uh, if you don't, then just don't click on the link, it's fine. Um, but it was, it was kind of incredible that, um, they did it like that because he just looks so bad they took his little like I don't know he has these little like um black marks on his cheeks right they took those and they made them look like whiskers so he, he looked like 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 Naruto almost but like bad crossover between Ash and Naruto and I'm like it's just it's bad <laughs> it's really really bad 
Anyway. It's okay. I haven't played a Pokemon game. I used to, uh... I used to be super into the Pokemon series. Like, uh, up until... Ruby Emeralds, I think. Ruby, Ruby Sapphire Emerald. That kind of point. I played, uh... I played through red, yellow, and blue, and green. I played through gold, silver, and I don't think I ever got crystal. No, no, I did. I did get crystal. I don't have it anymore, though. I lost it somewhere. It's kind of sad. Um... But I played through uh, Gold and Silver. I had both of those games. And uh, then Ruby and Emerald came out. I believe I got... I want to say Ruby first. A um, friend of mine got Emerald. And I was super upset about that. Because uh, I wanted Emerald. Because he, he had Emerald. And Emerald, you know, Emerald was the... Uh, the like third version, right? Like you always have with the Pokemon. You've always, or you, at least you used to. I don't know if it's still true, but back in the day, you used to have, you know, your red, your blue, right, and uh, your ruby and your sapphire, um, your gold and your silver, and you'd have the the various differences between them, right? So I'm not sure in red and blue what the difference was, but in gold and silver, you had um, ho 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 in gold and then you had uh, Lugia in silver er, in silver and in crystal you had access to both of them in uh, in ruby and sapphire you had Garudon in ruby Kyogre in sapphire and then in emerald you had access to both of them um, so I was always really annoyed that he had uh, not like annoyed at him but just annoyed in general that he had emerald and I didn't because I also wanted, oops, this isn't where I want to be. I also wanted Emerald because Emerald is better, right? Yeet! Uh, <laughs> so, uh, I, I eventually, I think I, no, I don't think I ever owned an Emerald copy myself. I, uh, I did end up, oh boy. Yeah, it's probably fine. Come on. Come on. There you go. Look at that. Easy. I did end up uh, playing it in a in a very highly legal manner. Um, otherwise, though. And uh, that was good fun. That was one of my favorite games, though, was, uh, was Ruby. Because I remember when you had to go and get, like, Rayquaza from the, the tower... It was uh, it was so much fun to uh, to try and like practice that like bicycle section and get good at that and uh, be able to like make it through and then finally get Rayquaza and I always from from like the very beginning of my life as a uh, as a as a professional Pokemon trainer as I am I've always had uh, this thing about Pokeballs right it isn't the too good to use syndrome it's uh. It's something different, because a lot of people don't end up using the Master Ball. It's like, well, I'll use it when I find something I can't catch. And they just never use it. It's like, well, I don't want to waste my Master Ball on Rayquaza. <laughs> you know? But for me, I just liked the... Uh, when you threw the Pokeball, I liked all of my Pokemon being in Pokeballs. So I would always catch every Pokemon that I ever caught with a Pokeball from the very beginning of ever. And I think you can change what Pokeball they're in. I believe in uh, in some of the games you can do that. But uh, I just, I figured like, just catch them in a Pokeball to begin with and then you don't have to worry about it, right? So that's what I, that's what I did. And uh, catching Rayquaza in a Pokeball was, uh, it's not a very easy task to do. Why did you get to hit me there? That's not, that's not fair, dude. It's not an easy task. Rayquaza is a, is a very hard catch. But I eventually did catch it in a Pokeball, and uh, that was just a really good feeling. I think I used my Master Ball on 
Garudon or Kyogre, whichever version of the game I had. I might have even had both. But I think I used my Master Ball there, and then it was like that moment where I, uh, where, where, that was like the first Master Ball. No, I used the Master Ball on, I think, Ditto, like the first Master Ball I ever got I used on a Ditto. I was like, I'll see what Master Ball, I'll see what it does. And I'm like, oh cool, it caught me a Ditto. And, uh, <laughs> big waste of a Master Ball there. Um, and then, uh, I was like, well, I just don't really like it. And I didn't learn what it was properly until, like, far later. And then I had it, I used it on, I think, Kyogre. And I was, like, throwing it out, and I'm like, yeah, I just, I really like my Pokemon all being in the same Pokeball, so. I've, uh, I've always, I've always strived to catch Pokemon in a, in a regular Pokeball. Even in Pokemon Go as I play that. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like and subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.